Right, time to talk Geopark, and uh, we're joined by Helen Jansen, one of the trustees of the Whitestone Waitaki Geopark Project. How are you doing? Absolutely splendid. It's a great day. Absolutely. Thank you for coming in. Now, what is the Geopark? It's an opportunity for Waitaki to take advantage of a framework that is a globally recognised framework based on the geology of the area. It's got to be unique, and in Waitaki we've got unique geology. We tell a story about incredibly ancient geotectonic movements right through to the present. It's about telling the story of the people, of the animals and the plants that have taken advantage of this sort of geology right up to the present day and going into the future because the the land that we live and work in sculpts the things that have happened and that do happen and can happen in the future. What's the potential as far as tourism is concerned here? Every other geopark in the world has increased their visitor numbers and increased their local economy many times. And so it's an opportunity which we have had scoped, which shows that there will be enormous benefit to the district, depending, of course, on what level of investment you're prepared to put into it. There's been a lot of talk about um, and figures banded about about the money that goes into it, but the amount that we're investing as far as the Waitaki district is concerned versus the amount of potential investment from external forces, it's we're only putting in a small portion potentially, aren't we? Absolutely, and we've broken it down into small stages. So and the district plan has ongoing support for it for 10 years. We've taken the annual amounts for the last couple of years and we have just been uh, granted money from the surplus of this year by the council in order to get us to the point where the UNESCO Geopark application can be completed and assessed and we're in a really good space to be accredited as a geopark. We can't count our chickens, but we will be in a really good place to do that. So why should people get behind the idea of the geopark? Because it's going to unify the district. It's going to give opportunity to all sorts of initially tourist opportunities from Flag Swamp through the East Coast and up through Omaru and right up to Oha Village. We've already seen excitement through the culinary world and the producers of food in the geogastronomy group that has started. They're champing at the bit to get this going, so this will be really Um, a great opportunity. We've got investors lined up already, ready to sign contracts. Now that we've got this assurance that we can get through to June, we will have those uh, investors joining up. So it's a huge opportunity for this district and for every man. It depends very much on the energy and enthusiasm that the district generates as to how much investment we will be able to bring. Thanks, Helen. We'll catch up with you again soon. Thank you very much.